Hi guys, this is Tweety. I got the new, uh, new snapshot, 12W41B, and, uh, I was just checking some stuff out, and I found this guy right here. I guess they can spawn on, uh, crafting tables now. Anyway, that's all I wanted to, uh, show for now. I'll be back in a little while. my design here for my my mushroom farm actually I did it this way they look like that call them, I'll call them cells I guess so uh, yeah the spawning mechanics for mushrooms is it chooses a block within the 3x3 three three area that's empty and if it's empty and it has a light level less than 12 what it'll do is pick another block within a 3x3 three three. so first it checks a 3x3x3 three by three by three around a mushroom and then chooses a 3x3 uh, three three from that block. And so I uh, worked on my mushroom farm and I put it all in there. I got, well, I'm not sure how many cells I have in there. I'll go ahead and count it now. But you can see that it's working. Just wait for them all to gather. And it's only been a couple minutes. Oh, why does it sound like there's a skeleton drowning in here? Oh, I bet I know why. Okay. Uh, anyway, let's count the cells. So, one. Two, three, four, five, all right, five, so ten, and I have one, two, three, four levels, so forty. I have forty cells in here. And I just played around with the water streams. Uh, this level I have one here. The next level I have one uh, here. And it kind of repeat, repeats. <coughs> so I have one here, one up, and then one in the corner. And I put them uh, one block into the wall, or rather two blocks into the wall, and everything's just separate with signs, so that the water doesn't stream over. But uh, there you see, I got nice water patterns. Even the back here, that back side right there, I got a stream that moves this direction. So, yeah, there's the mushroom farm. Um, really don't have a whole lot else that I wanted to do. Um, I've been playing around with a uh, with the new uh, anvil. I've been playing around with it just a little bit. To make one of those. Uh, it's actually quite resource hungry. You need 
six uh, blocks of iron. And there you go. You have an anvil. That's what the new uh, 12W41B snapshot. And yeah, you place it, right click on it. And what you can do is like throw your enchanted weapons in here. So I have a fortune two, efficiency three, unbreaking three, and a silk touch. And that'll give me fortune efficiency unbreaking. No, the silk touch must not be compatible with one of them. Probably fortune. So uh yeah, I won't do that, but and it said that it favors this first one. Ooh, that's too expensive. Nope. So weird I can do it that way. And it uses uh your experience levels. If you put in like with this, I keep getting power one bows from uh, my XP farm and you put in power one, power one bow, you get a power two bow. It's not too bad. That'll make it really nice for getting exactly what type of weapon or tool you want to get. Uh, oh and while I was in there I got creepered. I don't know where he came from. Maybe over here. I uh, took down some of the torches in here to test out the mushroom cell. And uh, yeah, I was in there and all of a sudden creepered from behind. Let me see how much time I've done on the video and uh, maybe think of something to do. I'll be back. Okay, I know what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go to the nether. And I have a blaze farm. My. Let me see. Way over there. And uh, I'm going to connect it with a rail car. I'll see you when I'm done. You guys hear that too? Oh, 
Hello. here. direction too. I thought it was over there. You see the uh, the idea of what I'm doing. I'll be back. All right, guys, I've finished. Go ahead and uh, make the run. Oh, looks like I need another power rail in there. Hopefully there's no zombie pigmen on the track. I also, uh, where I was building the bridges, I was using the nether rack, or the nether brick. Um, I swapped it out for the uh, stone brick, just because I was thinking that it probably a blaze or something might be be spawning on the nether brick. Or 
be more likely that they would spawn there. I had a heck of a time over here with some ghasts. These wouldn't leave me alone. And I'm out of glass now from that. And I'll probably still work on this. Maybe I'll do the whole thing in that stone brick all the way. And here we are. We've made it to my blaze farm. And the, uh, it was out in the open, so yeah. I wanted to make a XP blaze farm and that's what I ended up doing. This is uh, Ethos design. He got it from somebody else. I'm not sure. I well, didn't get the uh, design, but he got. Uh, uh, he was saying that somebody also had this uh, a similar idea to this. But uh, anyway, that's all for today. Have a good day.